Jake Ludington here at HPE Discover, and I'm here with Paul Ashwood, and we're right next to the booth that you guys have some contextually aware computing solutions. And I was wondering if you could talk a little bit about how you're changing the, con the customer user experience through right. contextually awareness. Absolutely. Yeah, so this is what we're calling the next generation of digital user experience. We're really bringing in a lot of new technology like wearable technology, like these smart glasses that we can put on, and how we can leverage those to either uh, drive employee productivity and efficiency. So through this smart glass technology, a technician could be working in hands-free mode while we're feeding them the right information they need in order to do a repair on that vehicle or to maintain that vehicle. Right, so they're getting everything that they need in order to do that and it's all done through augmented reality and smart glass technology. We also have retail solutions as well where we're doing things like facial recognition. Um, facial recognition then allows us to notify a store assistant that a customer has just entered into the retail store and it gives that, that store assistant information about the purchase history of that customer. So now they can go up and have an interaction with that customer, very personalized level of interaction, knowing about their purchase history, knowing who they are, what their profile is, what their preferences are. How do you go about avoiding having that seem creepy to the customer? So it's all based on opt-in, right? So we're trying to create a loyalty program that's incensed them to want to opt-in. Once they opt-in, take some photographs of their faces and load it into the system. Now we can recognize them. Now they know they're going to get that level of VIP treatment when they walk into the store. So that's kind of like the next uh, iteration of like the Safeway discount card. Ab absolutely, yeah, yeah. We're using some pretty innovative technology to do that. And it's all about, for us, contextual awareness, right? Knowing your location, knowing your profile, that's all contextual pieces of information that once we know that, can really change the way we interact with you as a customer. And so you were you're kind of say alluding to like these this headset that you have here, yes. And then we have a, a Nissan Leaf behind us, and so the headset can actually uh, provide some some heads up information about the car if you're if you're looking at the car, and and that can facilitate things like repairs. Yeah. So think about the technician who has to repair this vehicle. And instead of having to go off to a laptop or a manual and go look up information, the information's right here on the glass device. So he's operating hands-free. We're giving him step-by-step -step instructions on how to do that repair. We can even attach little videos or schematic diagrams to each step. So if he doesn't know what to do, and these are all voice activated, so he can just say play video, and he'll see an actual video that he can then follow along hands-free while he, he performs that repair. That's pretty cool. It is pretty cool. Very innovative. And this is something that uh, HPE has customers that are licensing this technology today? Yeah, so we're doing a lot of pilots and proof of concept with all of these different technology devices. These devices come from all different vendors, the smart glasses, the smart watches and the bands. What we do is integrate everything together. We actually build it into a complete user experience for a customer. So we really understand the user, understand their use case, what is the best device to send information to so that they can be more productive, or if they're a customer so that we can really personalize the interaction we have with them. And I think I overheard uh, something being said about that you actually have like the ability to monitor like the health of employees and things like that. What kind of scenario would you, you foresee somebody using that type of data? Yeah, so even with this smart technician solution, if you're a technician in oil and gas and you're out in the field and you're in some pretty harsh conditions, often working 10, 12 hours a day, through wristbands we can actually monitor blood pressure hydration levels, oxygen levels, and if anything goes out of a set of boundaries or conditions, we can notify supervisors that, hey, this guy needs to take a break, you know, there's a real health and safety concern here, this guy needs more hydration, needs some water, so we can notify supervisors, they can go and ensure that that employee takes a break before something, um, something bad happens and we have a safety issue on our hands. So, so it could make the, the workplace safer in, in the long run? Absolutely. We even have technology now where it's actually embedded inside the shirt that you wear. And so the sensors are inside the shirt. It's measuring how much you sweat. It's measuring your breathing, your oxygen levels, right? And it's all 
embedded inside of the shirt. It's all based on Wi-Fi technology. So we're picking up that signal as input. We're monitoring, looking for these triggers where you know, all of a sudden the, the blood pressure starts to spike. Uh, and that's how we keep the employees safe. That sounds like something I need for my runs. <laughs> Absolutely, yes.